Toss DM13, Decoy says. Ray pick him up. DM6. Decoy's pick. So, Greece, remind our viewers, um, and me, is this gonna be best of three or are we moving into best of five since it's the grand? ZTN is Decoy's pick. Fine. I I'm asking the admins, I don't know. Uh, I just get asked to cast stuff <laughs> when I show up. Are you on new medication tonight or something? <laughs> I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm, uh, I, it's like I'm one of those like, rare nights I have to be the straight man. Well, it's, it's one of those things where, um, it's one of those things where I had, like, a terrible day such yeah. that I was looking forward to this all, like, pretty much all day long. This is my day just kept getting worse and worse. I actually, you know, I, I, I wanted to say something really quick. I want to dedicate uh, this broadcast, actually. I really do. Uh, I have a friend of mine. Uh, her name is Lisa Tabor, and uh, you know she's just a little bit older than me, and uh, she's actually uh, struggling with terminal cancer. And um, she has basically worked her ass off, and she just got awarded her doctorate, and they gave it to her. Wow. Uh, like 10 days early or like 5 days early because they don't know if she's going to make it so uh, I just I just want to say uh, Tabor I love you and uh, you're awesome you're a beautiful inspiration and uh, I wish you all the uh, love and solace in the world so um, we're going to go ahead and uh, let this thing uh, play out um, we, we, we're getting some different map picks since we decided best of five is on the docket, guys. That we made a little, uh, little bit of a uh, admin on the spot decision. And let me just say this: I love how uh, if this becomes a regular thing, you know, it's a little bit loosey goosey. It's it doesn't have to be uh, just totally set in stone. The admins have been very flexible, uh, been able to get players in and rearrange brackets a little bit. But no one seems to mind because people just want to play the game. So that's fantastic. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna be able to see a best of five rather than a best of three for this, and that's great. We go over to DM13, and it looks like DM6 is the fifth. I actually missed some of those others because <laughs> I was busy talking. But uh, hopefully, we'll get some infos. Jeez, and when I said I had a bad day, I was thinking like stupid customers. I mean, I didn't have that. Ah, uh, no, of day. no, that's all right. Yeah, it's just been just been one of those things. But it looks like yeah. And um, actually, yeah, before I understand that. it looks like we're waiting well, on. Uh, is F3 up? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Okay. Going live in five. I like it. I'm gonna call the start of this one. We're gonna see. Uh, mm, decoy out of the joint because I have him spec. So there we go. And then we're going to watch him scramble for mega health. He realizes that it had not been taken yet. He's going to back off to his shotgun. Actually, could have gotten those shards. Would have actually got him a little bit better health in the situation. But he just, he's just making it over to the LG. So he's got everything he needs. Oh, look at this. Ray didn't even get to the lightning gun. Uh, I wonder where he spawned because we were watching decoy so intently. Uh, did you happen to see? I did not. My eyes have been glued to Decoy as well, but right now Decoy okay. is wondering almost the exact same thing. He's spawning each and every way, but now we see some grenades coming out of here. Decoy sees oh, he the hit opportunity, there. and yep. he knows and he got that Ray's going to be making a play for Mega. Yep. Yeah, that, that was a nice little tick of the tone that lets Decoy know exactly uh, what angle Ray was coming in on, and uh, he adjusted his aim accordingly, able to force Ray off of that Mega play, and now Decoy with a monstrous stack, 175, and full armor. And actually, if he goes back for that green, he could have had 200, 200, but that's okay. Uh, let's go watch Ray, who's at 100, 150 roughly, but just now getting a lightning gun and might be trapped here. Lightning, lightning gun, Decoy's going to win this. Faux show. We're going to see, we've got... Mega taken cleanly. Ray is still on the other side of the map. Finally coming out to center. And oh man, everything is gone. Everything's gone. He's like, Oops. Ray's like, I know, I know that there are spawn points for power-ups on this map. I have seen it before. However, 
since I have been playing, I've only seen those yellow things. So we're going to watch Decoy just to enjoy the fact that uh, he has map dominance. Although, yeah, back in time for red. Nice play here. Bit out of position. Ray doesn't punish him for it, though. Yeah, and if, if you time it right, you can look over from Rocket and get a Rocket smashing the guy who's trying to drop to red down to the lower level. Uh, that was the shot that Ray could have been looking for. Ooh, a little bit of LG on LG. And it's actually pretty strong there, knocking off Decoy's armor down to 17. Ray sitting pretty at 150 and uh, 77. I, I don't know where this is coming from. I just have like this little accent going on in my head, and I can't get it out. <laughs> All right. Uh, I am a white dude, and I will... Uh... You've been watching the O.J. Simpson trail too much. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, it's, it's all right. Um, <laughs> sorry. I just, because I, I was, I was going to say something earlier. I wanted to say something about Michael Steele. And I, I think that's maybe where my brain went subconsciously a little bit. Because I, I'm bothered by the fact that he's like this super nerdy oh. black guy. Trying to be not nerdy. Like embrace the nerdiness, man. Just be nerdy. It's okay. I mean, you look like Grover, or that guy, or that guy in the uh... <laughs> the guy that's always trying to order his soup. <laughs> anyway, let's focus on the badge. Ray's died. All right, all right. Sorry, tangent, tangent. Excuse me. That was a complete Chewbacca defense. All right, three minutes twenty seconds in. <laughs> Zero and one decoy, you know, just by uh, benefit of Ray killing himself with his own rocket, he's been sitting on this solid stack for the past couple m minutes, no problem. But right now, he's barely even seen hint of where Ray's gonna be coming from. Now we see the LG coming out. Five seconds to Mega. The drop down is early. There's a little tip down to Meg. Uh, I'm sorry, down to lava. But decoy is able to get the grab, and his exit is clean. He's now sitting at 101. 100, but if Ray knows what he's doing, and yes, he does with the Mega and a bit of L uh, yellow armor, he's able to get a pretty competent stack here himself, and with the steal for the LG yellow, he's actually looking pretty damn good, but now he needs to make an exit without eating a bouquet full of rockets, and he needs to find a way to do some damage of his own, but now he's got good timing on red. This is interestingly turning back around without a whole lot of damage coming out of either player. Yeah. Um, the control has kind of taken a shift. Uh-oh, uh-oh, who's going to get Mega? Ray's going to be like, I'm going to drop in on this because I had no idea it was up and I ate two rockets in my face. But hey, that's okay. I mean, maybe he didn't know when it was up and he was just trying to get offensive position so he didn't get uh, pummeled. But either way, ooh, this is nice positioning here uh, from Decoy. Able to hit one, two rockets, and we know that Ray is weak as all get out. And can Decoy finish the deal? Oh my god, look at this! No, he cannot with five health. Ray is like... <laughs> Go back for the 50. Go back for the 50. <laughs> Go back for the 50. That's right. Go back for the 50. That's the tagline for this VOD. <laughs> We're going back for the 50. Back for the... Okay, sorry. All right, we're done with that. Oh, God. <laughs> And that actually killed him too, because after he went back, he actually ended up getting in a fight there that he couldn't withstand. So that one, like, one and a half seconds right there between going, oh shit, I left the city behind, and I gotta go back and get it, that cost him. So now Decoy's up by one. Uh, nice little uh, silent gamers here. Um, with the pitter pat of the feet, that is. But it uh, looks like we're seeing an exchange, and it looks like Mr. Decoy's gonna come out on the top. And convincingly so, staffing up now to 125, 120-ish. And uh, a little bit of splash. Nice use of rockets and the LG damage. Oh, hell with LG damage when you can just hit a rocket to the face. Nice shot, Decoy. Now 3-0, and I'm really glad, Jahar, that we made this into a best of five. And yes, folks, oh, yeah. you heard that right. We made this into a best of five. We're just like, <laughs> hey, uh, we have time to cast all five if you want to do one. Is, is that cool? Can 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 we do that? Is that is that um, uh, amenable to, to both parties? Because uh, that's kind of important. Uh, we don't want to ruffle any feathers here. So, uh, decoy now four zero. I almost I almost didn't break.